Hey everybody, we have a Galaxy Tab 3 Lite screen repair today. Start out by heating up the screen. I just did it off camera. If you don't know how to do it, probably shouldn't be doing this repair. So just work your way around the screen with the flat tool. Pretty easy. It's just double sided adhesive. It's pretty sticky, so you might have to put it back on the heat a couple times. Slowly work your way around. Try not to touch the LCD with the flat tool. You know, on at least smudges, they're kind of hard to, to uh, clean off. But overall, pretty easy process if you got the tools and the heat. You can use a heat gun if you want, or a hair dryer if that's all you have. Remove the old adhesive, and then work your way around and pop these clips off. That just separate super easy. Go on, work your way around. Once you get the clips popped on three of the four sides, uh, it should pop out super easy. So boom, just like that. Unclipped, pop it out. Turned on while I was doing it, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off by loosening the battery cable which is this one right in the middle unhook it I'm going to use the tweezers pry it out just a teeny bit just enough for it to separate and turn off and there it's off so I'll put it back in clip it back down All right, now let's clean up the dust off the LCD real quick. Just little glass particles. Um, use a really soft cloth. Don't put a lot of pressure on it. Just kind of wipe across the surface. There you go, just like you're sweeping the floor. And just like that, we're good. Now, attaching the new digitizer is super duper easy. Buy it with pre-cut adhesive. Remove the screen cover, which is also the adhesive cover. Put the home button back in. Should fit right in the slot and line this guy up. You kind of got to line it up by eyeballing it um, since there's no rim to line it up with. And if you line it up crooked, you'll notice when you go to clip it back in the frame that it won't quite fit. But through many years of experience of doing this kind of repair, I can pop it on pretty easily. Plug it back in. Alright, that's all plugged in. Should be good to put the frame back on. Should fit in nice and easy. Just clip it all the way around. Just work your way around. The clips aren't super tough. They should hold pretty well. No screws or anything. And the adhesive sticks really well. Test out that home button, make sure it's nice and clicky. And that's that. So, go ahead and clamp it down. Make sure the adhesive has time to set. I usually just leave it in the clamp so the customer comes back to get it. Now we'll power it back up and test make sure that the new digitizer works. And there's the touch. Make sure you test the capacitive buttons. That works. Back button works. Test the home button. Everything works. We have another successful repair. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And have a great day.